Farm Shark here. This video is going to go over how to update firmware on a XT30 and an XT50. Let's start by going to your DMP remote link, hit new. It is specific on which you have an XT30 or a 50. It's going to be right here on the sticker. you want to put the account number in you want to plug your 399 cable into this port right here that says program make sure all keypads are disconnected from the data bus take the reset jumper off put it on the load and then momentary short the reset that will kick it into load. Next step is to fill out all your customer information and set up what type of connect connection you're going to do. This is going to be a 399 direct connect. You have to know what port you're going to be running on your computer. To get all your customer information in, hit OK. Go to Panel remote update go to the latest version firmware off the DMP site for an XT30 or a 50 whatever you have installed and then hit update once again the load the load jumper has got to be on the panel and then hit the reset switch to kick it in the load and all keypads have to be off the data bus that's very important all older cell cards the firmware has to be updated before it'll take a new LTE cell card so this must be done go to the latest version firmware off the DMP site before you upgrade the cell card and make sure you power the panel down before you swap the cell card so when you're done, take the load off, hit the reset, put the one back on the leg, discontinue, disconnect your 399, plug your keypads back up, power the panel down, swap the cell card, and you're done. This concludes the video today. Uh, please like and subscribe. And for future content, this is the Alarm Shark. Have a good day.